Now then guys, I'm Thingamajig and welcome to episode 18 of League United's career mode, Chasing the Dream. We've got two Premier League fixtures for you in this broadcast, starting with Reading away, that's at the Madstad, and then we finish off with Liverpool at home at the East Point. So, a couple of good games for you in this broadcast. Always tough. Ooh, we've got a loan offer for Connor Sean, see by the look of it. We'll go deal with the office first. That's the first Saudi Arabian club I've ever had coming to loan one of my players. I've had one of my loan players been already on loan at a Saudi Arabian club, but never never while active. Oh Three weeks. Right, let's go do some training. Good man. Head in accuracy, ninety nine. High pressure finishing, yeah. Right, let's simulate them, see how the boys do. Average, McKees. Excellent there. McKees is a bit of a monster. Anthos is worth 20 million. Right, let's advance. I don't actually know if it's a first or second team game against Reading. I presume second because Bellerin's been injured, that means first team played. That's my watch thinking anyway. He is exceptionally good. Now look in Denmark, boss. We haven't found me that special player. Is oh no, they've rearranged the fixture. Oh, right then, definitely a second team game then. I 
doing that because believe it or not Pogba had an amazing game can't believe Brandt got injured again for another three bloody months now change that because Bellerin's injured so Skovgar's gonna have to go in Pogba's coming off at bench Pogba no oh, no he's has to be sold he's going off If I doubt it that Bellerin will be ready for next week. We shall see. Let's advance. No look in the Republic of Ireland, boss. Not doing national teams anymore. Jonas is gone. Now, ugh, I hate doing this. There's a week in between games, so they should be alright. Fontana's going to have to come out. Right midfield, left midfield. Attacking midfield. I need a defender now. Guaron. So, right, right, left, striker, goalie. You can come out actually. Goalie, attacker midfielder, defensive midfielder. Right, Varane's back, yeah, McKee, Tierney, Pogba, Cabello, Asensio, yeah. Welcome to the channel, guys. Hope you're all well. Hope Monday's treating you okay. 18 points clear in league. Where are Reading? Seventh, oh, they're not doing too bad. This isn't one of them games I've been playing well of late and 
I found that you always have one of the <laughs> a downturn. Mind you, I prefer it to be this game than the next one. Hi there, I'm Martin Tyler. With me today, Alex no Smith. Either. Welcome to today's game. Our match today, it's Reading against Leeds United. Yellow gloves. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Well, they come here, the visitors, with this wonderful defensive record. Actually, it is the best defensive record in the division. Well, right, visitors. Yeah, they are. Right, visitors. The and they've also got great understanding across that back line. Leeds that United. means that it's well, all going to go tits up this game. game. <laughs> at home against Southampton. Yeah, 3 0. Comfortable for them, and uh, they're flying at the moment. I think they'll win again. Reading are ready to go with this lineup. We put it up as a 5-2-3. It could be 3-4-3, three, three, couldn't it, if the wide players get forward from the back? Yeah, I think it's one of those. It could be anything. He's got his shot off now. Oh. It was a real opportunity, but there might be a key moment in there from a defensive point of view. Yeah, well, Pumper really has been pants all quickly. season. He didn't miss by much, and then the past two he's games, he's played pretty he's well. Well, he's scored five goals like in two it's games. So. It's a quick break. Needs to stay cool now. Penalty. I don't know what made that fell over. Slow getting to that one. It's a wonderful game involving Liverpool. Alan McAnally loving it. I'm sorry I had to cut him short, really. The score is now 1 0. Well, they could pose some danger now to take the lead. Well, it's one of those that hits the post and goes in to the Spawny. delight of the scorer. He might have mishit it. I don't know, but he doesn't care. Well, you're too young to remember, Alan. They used to have square goalposts, and a lot more came out than went in in those days. So, for the attackers, that's a, a bonus of the change in the technology. Um, yeah. Yeah, and I think he deserved that, though, because Not a square uh, anymore. Struck it well and right into the corner. Well, Leeds United in control, and that's what we would have expected coming here today. Now Evans. Trying to good vision. No chance. Got in the way. And the referee points for a goal kick. This is the kind of uh, pitch that I think attacking players favour. Looks Alan, don't like they? it's really. I think they do, yeah, because uh, it means mistakes from defenders and uh, you know a little bit of miscontrol. Not mistakes from strikers. And, uh, you're in. Velotti. Moving forward with some danger. Oh, he's been called offside here. A lot of newspaper inches devoted to this particular manager and the temptation of uh, an international job, but we understand that he's turned that down. Yeah, well, yeah, I have the England job and left fight. it. Only he could tell you that. Um, he doesn't see it as the job for him, quite clearly. Um, whether that's going to be the case in the future. I don't know because I think most managers they like to further their ambitions, don't they? And if he if he does get the job that he should have given us straight away, proper attacking well here. Gonna try one now. Very penalty. Oh, can you believe it? Yep. It is a penalty. Send him off. Pop it now. Did you see anything cynical in that, Alan? Yeah, he saw the ball and he went for it, but he was just a bit slow and definitely a foul. He scored from the spot. No worry about the pressure or the responsibility here, and there's the goal. Yeah, the way he walked up to it, you could just see he was going to score. So confident. So confident. So confident. 
<coughs> Manchester City in the Premier League. And yeah, Manchester United lost to West Bromwich Albion, which is always good to hear. Especially when West Brom at bottom of the league and like now Marcus Rashford. nine points good progress with this attack. Good behind everybody else. They got that challenge in. Worst team in the league as Rashford. such. And they get it away. Fogba. Bad pass again. Now Evans. On the attack here, in comes the challenge. The defences, defences are definitely better at world class. I've noticed that past couple of seasons. Slipping it through. Look, Marco Asensio. Goal! Well, they look pleased with themselves and no wonder with the way they stoked the ball about and created the finish, picked out the spare man in the box. Two for him on the day and two very well taken goals. Another angle on it here. Fifteen goals. He's the league's top scorer. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. So That's much on that decision again. Attack. And he gives it back to it. And here they are on the attack. Good defensive clearance there. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. Thought that we're going to drop to Belletti then. Belotti, whatever you call him. Strong challenge. Give over. Well, the ball's been deflected out, so it'll be a throw in. Now Evans. Well, there is cover if he loses the ball, but he won't want to do that here. Quick witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. They've got numbers in this attack, and it looks dangerous. It's a quick break, shots on here. It was a real opportunity, but there might be a key moment in there. From a defensive point of view, yeah, well, they really did converge on him quickly. He didn't miss by much, but he's missed it. Yeah, thank you for choosing everything, Imaging guys. It is really appreciated. Now Marcus Rashford. And, oh, not to have her. And now the goalkeeper can maybe think about starting an attack. Well read by the defender. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Played in the clear. Marco Asensio. Oh, I thought that was going wide. Patrick. He is a class above is that kid. And it's a perfect day for the player. Well, no wonder he's wheeling away in a super celebration. To get a hat trick is a fantastic experience, and he's just done that. Well, having scored two, he was just so full of confidence, and he never looked like missing that chance. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is he getting results out there. And the shape is an oblong. One team really on their game today, the other very off colour. Actually, it's a star. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Now to play for a throw. Gregory Sertic. We're going to get a corner here because that of that deflection. Not. Corner swung in. Well, I thought really that was just going to pop yeah, in that. He's heading, and you can see why there with that effort. It's another chance, really, and any sort of contact there, and you think it must go in, but it didn't go in. Oh, what a golden opportunity! Because that was a really good ball in from out wide, and 
Just didn't time his header. That looks like um That left winger I had. I don't know if I still got him. Wood Woodburn. Bit wrong way then. On the move and able to cut out the pass. I don't know if I've sold him or he's just on loan. Yeah, I, I've had what might be attested to a Stalin purge. Here, having worked hard to get the football back, played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. The referee has indicated and the uh, fourth official has minutes. held up the board to say four more minutes. Ben Woodburn, that's him. Good reading of the play by the defender. They could pose some danger now. Gregory Sertic. And here's the shot. Damn. Half time whistle. And Leeds United are in front at the break. Only one team in it. As we head for half time, only one team in it. The other team, oh, they are struggling. Well, wildly different team talks, I think, from the managers. One's got an awful lot of work to do. Well, we wonder if the second half is going to be like the first. I'm going to give it a few more minutes and bring uh, Asensio off. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. And Evans. No point risking him, is there? Well, they're in a good position here. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Come on, Ansis, you've got to be better than that. Now you can cross it. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems, and certainly not the goalkeeper. Well, this is a real shock. You can see it in the faces of the players, and you can hear it in the lack of noise, if you like, from the supporters. Well, those fans can't even be bothered to give their players any stick at the moment. They're just... Oh. Into silence. So many media outlets these days, and at the moment they're being dominated by just one story: this potential offer from Bayern Munich. Wouldn't it just? The rumours have been swirling for quite some time. Good, must be to see if there's any substance to them. We could be in. In on the goalkeeper. He's in now. Shit. Here we'll see what they can manage from the corner. And the manager deciding to welcome to the channel herbal cake a new player hope you are well thank you for flying everything image in goes the corner well it's come to nothing in the end good defensive clearance there richards nice bit of interplay between these two that'll be a throw He's got his shot off now. That's an easy piece of goalkeeping. Mendigas Pogba plays like a prune sometimes. And by sometimes I mean 90% of the time. Well, that was an easy piece of I do support Leeds it. myself, yes. I think the you? White man's got a chance here. There's space opening them up with a through pass. Played in the clear. Well in the teeth. Well. Mm. 
moving with some danger to the opposition now they're here Piranha. challenges for the ball and he's used his head there to keep his side in possession neatly intercepted I'm gonna make some changes ah Wolves congratulations on your promotion hope you have a good season next season Right, we'll put Al Galley on. Give one at youth team a run out. Had some good players this season of Wolves, have done really well. I'm gonna put Sancho on. I do this career mode and this I do two games a day on this on goes onto YouTube it's an FA Cup fixture. It's and then I do another career mode yeah, that some of my viewers asked me to well to joining you in the country for it. they wanted me to bit Forest Green Rovers oh, manager and get them into the Premier League now Marcus Rashford attacking now Hughes that's what about Leeds is next interesting well, by, by interest United I mean difficult in the next match in the FA Cup and uh and I do think whoever scores first. Shot on! There'll be a signal here at the corner. Well, Alan, it is the uh, institution now. Zaza. He's still got a cold. To see it, Martin. And uh, he'll be grabbing that match ball at the end of this match. The attacking team thought they could win it back and very nearly did. Read the intentions of the opposition that there was to shite. make the interception. Getting forward well as a team now. And they've cut it out. Barrett. Good vision. The proper Mukta, not the Danish the Mukta. Sancho. Well, that's a lovely piece of skill. Oh. Barrett. Leandro Bakuna. Return pass. Puro. in the right place at the right time to cut it out. Now this looks promising. They'll need to try and get the ball back now. Leandro Bakuna. Entity. AKA Jacob. Barrett. How goes it? A couple of teammates who are clearly on the same wavelength. Now here's a chance. Oh, come on. He's coming forward with some danger. That's an excellent cross. Only partially cleared, so shots on here. Oh, that'll have hurt. Well, I don't know who the lad saw there passing the ball. Somebody in the crowd, maybe. He's looking for the cross, trying to pick out someone in the centre. Thank you for the follow. Herbal cake is greatly appreciated. Leandro Bakuna. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking good from their point of view. Well in. The referee has indicated there will be a Not really turd. What's McKeith doing up there? And here's the shot. Ooh. Keeper pushes it away from the goal. I'm doing pretty well, Jacob. Thank you. Yourself? Entity. Barrett. A.K.A. Jacob. There we are, final whistle. Asensio with tens. Let's just hope we do as well against United next. Everton, one. Manchester United, two. Mm. Newcastle United, nil. 
Liverpool 1. Reading 0, Leeds United 4. Swansea City 2, Leicester City 0. Tottenham Hotspur 2, West Ham United 1. Watford 0, Arsenal 1. Now let's see what effect that's had on the league standings. At the top of the table remain we'll Leeds look United him. with 57 points. In second, Swansea City with 39 yeah, points. We'll in we'll third, rising in, up uh, the table are Tottenham Hotspur with 38 points. Looks like it's going to be fourth, really low, moving down low rated. Are Manchester City with 35 points, with a game in hand on the team above. In fifth, climbing the table are Manchester United with 35 points, but only behind on goal difference. In sixth and falling are Stoke City with 35 points. With a game in hand. Got to sign him. Above. That's the right name. In seventh, moving down are Everton with 33 points. In eighth and falling are Reading with 33 points, but only behind on goal difference. Bottom of the table, Newcastle United. I've decided. With well, I didn't points. decide. And then reading up the table, second bottom, Leicester City came up with, with the theory that points. for Leeds third United, your team. 19 points. If all under actual rate in a 57, I don't think it's on gold take too long to build up like that. 46 with 20 points, 54. I'm gonna keep him just because of his name. Good sixty. Fifty-one. I'll keep her for a bit if it the start taking too long. I'll have to get shot. Marco Asensio, the last match. Thanks for playing quite all right. You scored an hat trick. The wage. <laughs> Set up a scouting network. Um, any preferences, guys? Think of somewhere to send someone. Argentine, Argentinian attacker. And a German playmaker. Them... You've team players that I've just brought up. I won't mind a few of them in my bloody forest green. Career mode. Right, let's do some training. Himurana. I get some right complicated bloody names, me. I can't believe Martin's attacking position is so low for a striker. Defending endurance. Good 
field as Vieira. Pass interception, goal there. I'll keep him because you need an extra keeper. Right, let's simulate them, let's see how the boys do. Scovgard let me down. Fontana had a good session. Scovgard did let me down. No lucky turkey boss, somebody's been and gobbled up all the good players. Gobble, gobble, gobble. No lucky turkey boss. 36 million for Kennedy, that ain't so much money, daft, only paid 10 for him. He has had a renaissance as Kennedy. This is a rearranged game. We weren't even supposed to be having this game even at the start of the broadcast. No looking Brazil boss. Renato Sanchez, that's his third or fourth transfer since I've started this career. He was at Swansea on loan. Then Burnley bought him. Then he went somewhere in France, I think it was. <laughs> Another youth team graduate people want to spend vast amounts of money on. This is only his third season. How many Forest Green Rovers goalkeeper gets that good in three seasons? Don't think he will though. So what? So it's round four of Emirates FA Cup. And on my Forest Green Rovers career, me and Mansfield got to the semi-finals at Calibou Cup. I actually got to the final and beat Man United. Which means I've qualified 
UEFA Europa Cup. So I'm in League One. Playing in Europa Cup. And my first game is against Real Sociedad. Sent one of my coaches to Egypt on Forest Green as well. I hope they bring some players like that back. Feeling depreciated. Yep. Manchester United do that. Right, let's see if we can progress. In the fuck up. I mean, fuck FA Cup. It's fair play when you think about it, yeah. But you could also say you've got more fighting spirit because you never let it die. It's easy to dominate someday, but is it easy to come back? To keep plugging away and come back? Well, tension in the air here. It's got all the ingredients, hasn't it? And it's our main feature today on EA TV. Join us soon. I think the billing says almost all of it, Alan, doesn't it? The Emirates FA Cup. It's brilliant to be here. It certainly is. Still got a magic attached to it, this competition. And uh, I've got a feeling we're going to get a good game. And the game today... Good game, good United game. United versus Manchester United. Man City it's were crowned champions yesterday's as a... ...to the rivalry between these two teams. I think we're Who's going to see that? a match of real passion as well as skill. Because Man United got beat by West Brom. <laughs> There's a couple of players who you might keep a special eye out for today. Alan Smith's certainly going to do that. Well, we've earmarked these two because they have been in fantastic form this season. It's been a pleasure to watch them. Law of Jante. Check for you on the Leeds United lineup. Yeah, they have been good. They need to start dominating Europe where they're going to be. I'm going to be looked at as a, really a great club like Leeds. Gunning for another win after that away victory against Reading. Fantastic 4-0 win. Strikers were on fire. Maybe a draw though today against a good side. I'd be happy with a draw actually. 
It's with Marco Asensio. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Malotti, neatly intercepted. Sergio Roberto. I've got three ex scum. I'm um, three ex Man United players. Coman. Romelu Lukaku. Pogba. Malotti. Took too long. There's good progress with this attack. Bastard. Referee says play on gives Manchester United the advantage. Can't read that at the minute, Zaza. Pull. Sergio Roberto. Come on. Shouldn't have come in. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. So guiding it through the defenders. And that will be a corner for United. The good thing about these pitches these days, even when we're getting rain like we're getting here, it just goes straight through. It does, and uh, it means the ball moves so I'm fast. I'm it now, I've read surface, it. And, uh, that's great for attacking, quick play. In goes the corner. Save! Yeah, we have the same sort of thing. Don't ever think you're better than anybody else. And Here's Martial. Yeah. With good vision. And they cut it out. Now that's class defensive work. Well, this attack got a bit of menace to it. Open it for score. Oh, you twank! Here's a corner to come for Leeds. I know it wasn't shit, I've read it. He's put in the corner. Jump it to Tanas. It's with Marco Asensio. Deep defending here, but he's got the ball. Sergio Roberto. Nice bit of interplay between these two. There's some potential in this move. He needs a run from his teammates to help him out. A little private game between the two of them. And they're keeping the ball, that's the important thing. Pogba, what are you doing? Stood round like a Anthony. turnip, you great. Now Anthony Martial. Thought he was going to go down like bastards. Well, he's knocked it in, and they've got the lead now. It hasn't come easily. Pogba let him do that. They're delighted with it. It was a well-crafted move and a fine finish at the end of it. Well, it's ended up in the back of the net, quite high up too. Yeah, I'm not sure whether we actually meant it just to. Go under the bar. Maybe we'll oh, for fuck's sake, what was the That's point? Sergio Roberto. Here's Kingsley Coman. Pogba. Velotti. Marco Asensio. Now Marcus Rashford. Oh, it's a corner. Oh, that deflection. We can see it another time, Alan. This vital match leading goal. Corner played into the middle. He's blocked up well. Sergio Roberto. Anthony Martial. Anzini. In with a chance. Very, very close. I'm missing Bellerin's pace. Well, I think half the crowd, you know, thought that was going to nestle in the corner. Of the I net thought we were going in as well. It's with Marco Asensio. 
Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Oh, for fuck's sake. Play back. Sergi Roberto. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Here's Martial. Well, it's threading it through. Manchester United putting this attack together well. Then what better than me? That's the brilliance of the back with good vision. A bit of a sprint for the goalkeeper, but he made it. It's a big game involving Manchester no, City. Alan McAnally is reporting on it for us. I'm sorry, I had to cut it short. The score is now 2-1. They could pose some danger now. It's with Marco Asensio. They can be quick on the break now. Well, let's go over to the Emirates Stadium and hear from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Everton. Guiding it through. To bring them level. Well, that's the sign of a top-class player to score like that. Malkin. Smoking out. Yeah, 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 yeah. <coughs> the just, it went in off the keeper. Well, I think it was just a tear on the ball, Martin. It was too much for him. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. <laughs> cool but broken inside. Great news for the manager because I think he made uh, a couple of changes there, and now they're back. I am as terms. well. Fat and full of so out of date food. We go at one all. Pool. My apologies to Alan McAnally and to you for interrupting him. But Everton got that goal. And that's the first goal of the game. It's 1 0. Now Anthony Martial. Bob was not doing much again. It's funny, but also sad it is. Marco Asensio. All alone in the middle. Oh, are you? The great saves. Had no right to stop that. Holy shit, that was a right save. The bastard. player that we're featuring here has done well he's certainly been an influence on this first half well he stepped forward for his team there what a save that would amazing been, what you would say on the best of four. I'm gonna try and clip that for the second half of this Emirates FA Cup tie. Yeah, the first half wasn't bad. Hoping for more of the same here. I thought that was going to be a definite goal. Quick. Fucking pumping Quick. again, you yeah. useless French there. fuck. Yeah, and I said the F word. French. Can't keep the ball at the moment. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Pool. Pool. Attacking now. Well, the not supposed to be out here, but um, Come on, Pogba. Uh, Pogba. Marco Asensio. He can't put them in front. Get him. What a big goal that might turn out to be. He 
can't have scored many better than this with the bend he's imparted onto the ball well give him credit you could see exactly what he set out to do there and executed it perfectly a tactical substitution for the losing team here it's Manchester United who are losing right now Sergi Roberto Rashford Marco Asensio for this it should get them across the line at the end of the match we'll see well, he's welcome, to the chunkle, ju chunkle. <laughs> welcome to the channel chunkle welcome to the channel junkie joe hope you are well and that's a goal well worth analyzing again His team haven't been at it, and look at the manager's face. He can't believe what they're giving him out there. 3-1 the scoreline as we restart the game. Belotti. Marco Asensio. Turning out to be a dream performance from this chap so far, Alan. Yeah, he's dominating things, isn't he? This could be a chance. Just the keeper to beat. Keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. Oh, what Matt Rashford, Rashford wouldn't even look the in the right way. Make the interception. Thiago guided through. It must be. Well, then it goes. Not quite as good as De Gea's save, but it was a save. Martial. I've never seen a save like that on FIFA. No way! No way! It's giving the penalty. The penalty. I think it was clear cut. The fact that the referee's not booked anyone is that a bit lenient? Maybe, but on the plus side, I think he's showing a bit of common sense. He got the ball. The penalty, I feel, is punishment enough. I am going to the keeper's right he's missed it well sometimes you can tell in the run up and looked at his eyes he did not look confident at all threads it through into the attacking third looking for support got to be they scored well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances, and it is a knack. That does extend their margin now at an important time. There's a huge golfing class out there, Martin. Well, and that's obviously, there's a the golfing line. class. It's Leeds and Manchester United. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing one team really on their game today the other very off colour yeah I know but I bought Rashford from Real Madrid so I feel better about that and I didn't pay any money for Pogba and I'm glad to see his pants Roman but he has Lukaku. been he hasn't played well this game or the lads game but Thiago. the two games before that he scored five goals Tiago, an update from the Etihad from Ala Makinali. It's a third goal for Manchester City. 72 minutes played, 3 1. Thanks, Alan. Oh, can he get it away here? They've lost the ball, and the counter attack could be. This is how they played in the clear. Real chance now. Two. I think you cover more ground when you. 
complex when you're um, dribbling the ball. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. And they've cut it out. Slip through. To Sergio Roberto. Here's Kingsley Coman. Lanzini. Hold up in some more. Here's a chance to attack. Marco Asensio. Goal! Well, they look pleased with themselves, and no wonder the way they stroked the ball about and created the finish. Picked out the spare man in the Black box. attack. Welcome to the channel. Increase their lead here, and that I know I don't know why Jose yeah, Jose no, doesn't seem better. to like him, does he? Or he seems to have fallen out with him, at least. Right. It's last ten minutes. No, you beat man. I will be on with Forest Green Rovers shortly after I finish this Zaza, yes. The team out here today and that scoreline reflects that. And we can see a slightly different viewpoint on it. I've also qualified for Europe with Forest Green Rovers by winning the Caribou Cup. So I'm in the Europa League, Euro League, whatever they call it on this. I don't think we expected this. Such a one sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Nice interplay between the two of them. Into the middle it goes from Anthony Martial. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. Here's an opportunity. And here's the shot. <laughs> oh, bastard! <laughs> the defender just <laughs> put him off yeah he's got to take a lot of credit for that because uh, he had Can't to take a shot quickly the lad who was trying to score well, they could pose some danger now Sancho Lanzini it's Pereira Could give that lad a bit of leeway. He's only a seventeen-year-old. Well as a team now. And now the shot. Ooh. Real miscue here. Three minutes of added time. Neatly intercepted. And shoots. Shot Penalty. <laughs> you can have one. I should have one. Oh, I did have one. Oh, that last game. Attacking now. He's got his shot off now. Goal. Well, they've taken the low route here, and they've got themselves a goal well out of the keeper's reach. Jaden Sancho. Well, I didn't see it as being as one-sided as it's turned out, Martin. But uh, yet another goal and a good one too here in stoppage time. Well, disappointment for the losing team, but. I'm afraid the winners deserve this margin, which is being confirmed by this very late goal. Yeah, it's been a, a walkover. You don't often get games like this at this particular level, but so one-sided. There's no doubt that the scoreline reflects 
realistically the nature of the game. Excellent. Let's go to the Emirates Stadium and here. Excellent. Unfortunately, guys, that's it for this broadcast. I hope you enjoyed the two games that I brought to you there. A few the goals as well, which is Challenge Cup. always nice. And one, beating Manchester Everton United one. always Bolton Wanderers makes your one. day brighter. Keens Dons, one. Um, Brentford, nil. Sunderland, I did one. check the settings Burnley, before I one. started as well, and we Burnley, are on world nil. class. Chelsea, three. So, Leicester City, one. I was right, I am on world class. Anyway, as I said, I hope you enjoyed the broadcast. If you did, it'd be awesome if you could hit that follow button if you haven't already. And if you do, please don't forget to turn notifications on, then you won't miss any of my future shenanigans. You also get um, notifications when I'm live if you do that, obviously, because it does what it says on the tin. Also, if you follow me on Twitter, which is at Thingamajig, you'll receive tweets when I start broadcasting or when I start a rerun. You'll also receive regular tweets containing discount codes from sponsors. You'll get notifications of the game clips and the past live stream playlists that are on my YouTube channel, which is forward slash Thingamajig. And there's loads of other content in there too, other career modes, battlefield games, so loads of stuff as always though thanks for stopping by I really can't thank you enough for taking time out of your busy lives to come and watch my latest gaming adventures it blows me out of the water that you take your time out to come and listen to me talk crap most of the time so I can't thank you enough for that I will try and do better the next time the next time will be very shortly with Forest Green Rovers but the next time with Leeds United will consist of two games it will start with a Premier League fixture against Liverpool that's at home at the East Point and it will finish off with another Premier League fixture that's against Manchester United and that's away at the Theatre of Screams I mean Dreams um, I look forward to seeing you there and I look forward to seeing you at the Forest Green Rovers career mode but until then, I'm Thingamajig, and I shall see you in a bit.